G'day there everyone, Daniel Anderson here. Now one of the great little features that is uh, recently rolled out to Microsoft Teams is the ability to stay on top of those messages that you may not have time to act upon uh, right in that particular moment. You can click the three little dots and you can create a task for yourself from a particular message. So here in a message, we can click the dots, under more actions, we've got the ability here to create a task. And you can see that we've got all the, uh, the, the information out of the task with the link to the, the message itself so we can get back to that message. We can set priorities and due dates and things like that. Now, one of the, the hidden, well not hidden, but uh, maybe unknown functionalities here that if you're also using Planner, you can actually create these tasks and assign them in Planner as well as Microsoft To Do. So you can see here where, where I click this drop down of Create In, I've got my task lists in To Do, but I've also got two plans here that are associated to these two teams. So I've got the Mark 8 project team, we've got a planner plan there uh, in the general channel, and we've also got one in the Contoso marketing team. So what we can do here is I, can, I might want to uh, create this task and assign it to somebody in the Mark 8 project team. All right, so you can see I can even choose the buckets. Let's choose launch. We'll go, we'll keep this as not started. We'll set a due date of next week. We'll set the priority as really important. And let's now go ahead and assign that to, let's say Adele, all right? And what we'll do here is we'll go add a task. And you can see that it posts a reply about this task as well. And now that task has been created. So see here, what is actually being done is a, an adaptive card's been posted as a reply here to that particular message. You can see that a task's been created, who it's been assigned to, and then you can also jump in and have a look at the details. Now, if we jump over to the Tasks by Planner app here, this is an aggregation of To Do and Planner as well. And then what we can see here is I've got my shared plans, I've got my tasks out of To Do, and I've got anything that's uh, this special list here that's anything that's been assigned to me. Now, if I click on the Mark 8 project team, you can see that uh, that task has now been created, it's been assigned, it's been marked as important, there's the due date, and there's the bucket that it's in also. So not only with that functionality of creating a task can you do that for yourself, you can actually do that uh, to any and add that to any plans that you are utilizing in your teams as well. So a really great piece of functionality there and integration to assign tasks to people in your team, but also for yourself personally. Thanks for watching. Hope that brings you some value. See you next time.